welcome back to the channel and if it's your first time here welcome so this is what we're looking at today it's the 10 in 1 USB C hub by Acasis with a hidden M.2 SSD NVMe drive so I've uh, reviewed a couple different drives on the channel but I think this one for me personally this one is fits all my needs and it's the perfect solution to what I need now I'll show you the box it comes in so this is the box it comes in so we can see 10 in 1 USB C hub with SSD enclosure by Acasis. We've got some features on the front so they can do M.2 NVMe or SSD drives up to a thousand megabits transfer speed up to eight terabytes of storage 100 watt power delivery fast charging 4k output for an extra display and is compatible with four different SSD sizes comes in three different colors silver gray black I went for the gray one just so it matches my space gray MacBook Air we want everything to match don't we and uh, package contents let's take a look 10 in 1 USB C hub with SSD enclosure, Type C cable, silicon cover, thermal pad, rubber grommet, USB uh, manual. And then we've got some fancy features on the back, which I'll let you pause and have a look if you want to see. The build quality of this is uh, surprisingly good. It's it feels exactly like as if Apple would have made it. So you've got it's metal all the way around. You've got the SSD NVMe drive hidden in there. You've got this little rubber grommet thing that you put in there to put the drive in. And then you just close it up and forget about it with that cover. Then we've got USB-C 3.0 port, USB-C 3.1 port, Type-C 3.1 port, audio port, micro SD and SD card slot port, gigabyte Ethernet, HDMI, power delivery port, so you can charge your MacBook while this is connected as well. And we've got a PC port, which is the one you use to connect to the MacBook or Windows laptop, whatever. Comes with this cable, Nice short cable so you don't have to faff around with a long cable because let's face it, if you're plugging this in, you don't need a long cable. Also what it comes with that's pretty good is this silicone cover, which the first time I've seen it on a external hard drive, but I'll show you why. So this goes all the way around. Like I said, because it is like a metal build, one thing you don't want to do is drop it because if you do drop it, you can get dents and stuff in it, scratches, whatnot. This basically protects it just like a phone case would protect the phone. So you can be sure that it won't damage any of the corners or any of the metal on the front bottom or sides just because it's got that got that lip on there as well next thing we're going to do is plug it into the laptop and i'll show you some speeds on there bear in mind it does say up to a thousand megabits transfer speed there is limitations depending on what drive you're using and what machine you're using so for example the m1 MacBook here has certain limitations where it can't transfer that speed with using this through the cable. So I'm going to show you on screen now me testing out this. And you'll see that I'm getting around 600, 630 read and write, which is amazing to me because on the other drive I did the review, it could only take a SATA SSD. And that was only getting me around 300, 320 megabits per second read and write. So this is already double the improvement. I believe, I don't want to get it wrong, but I believe it retails at around $100 to $120, but prices fluctuate, so I don't want to be 100% there. If you do want to check it out, I will make sure to leave a link in the description below so you can grab yourself one if you like. But overall, fantastic piece of kit. Perfect for not only laptops and MacBooks and stuff, but... Another good advantage is, is you can use this with your iPad. So as we know, the iPad only has one port on the bottom. So plugging it into there, you have access to all these different ports, memory card slots, audio ports, Ethernet and HDMI port, etc. And it's quite small. So if we take a look and compare it to say like my iPhone 13 Pro, size wise, it's not that much. It's like double the thickness, but then it's not that big. So you can see it now compared when it's next to my MacBook Air that it doesn't take up much room, but it gives you so much, so much more convenience of these different ports and it's very convenient to carry, pop it in your bag, etc. like that. Something I've been wanting to get for a while, but Acasis were nice enough to send me this one out. So I've been using it and this is my main storage device at the moment. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope this helped you and hope it helped you make a decision up if you did one or want one. If you did enjoy the video, please uh, do subscribe below as it does help the channel. 
and do like the video as it does help get pushed out to more people there'll be more macbook videos and stuff coming out on the channel soon so be sure to keep checking and i'll catch you guys on the next one